Cristiano Ronaldo shares adorable gym selfie with partner Georgina Rodriguez on social media Dear friends, welcome to my channel, I am Maya, hope your day is so well. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe the channel. Cristiano Ronaldo has shared a heartwarming snap of himself and partner Georgina Rodriguez working out at the gym. Ronaldo, 39, and Rodriguez, 30, have been together since 2016 after meeting, while the five-time Ballon d'Or winner was at Real Madrid. They've since moved to Italy, England, and most recently Saudi Arabia. The loving couple headed to Saudi after Ronaldo made a blockbuster move to Al Nasser in January 2023. The five-time UEFA Champions League winner has lit up the Saudi Pro League with 36 goals and 12 assists in 37 games across competitions this season. One key aspect of Ronaldo remaining at the top of world football is his relentless gym work. He's one of the most highly admired professional athletes in any sport in history. Georgina Rodriguez is also known for her fitness as she's often seen posting videos of herself working out in the gym. She is a brand ambassador activewear brand Alo Yoga, alongside Lionel Messi's wife Antonella Rocuzzo. Rocuzzo and Ronaldo were busy at the gym on Wednesday, April 10. The Spanish model wore a beige vest with brown leggings and white trainers with a blue sole. The Portugal captain donned a white shirt with orange shorts and white trainers. Ronaldo shared a picture of the pair working out on his Instagram story. Ronaldo may have let off steam in the gym after Al Nasser's controversial exit from the Saudi Super Cup. The iconic forward was sent off for violent conduct in a 2-1 loss to title rivals Al Hilal in the Super Cup semifinals on Monday, April 8. Cristiano Ronaldo and Georgina Rodriguez took the family for a vacation Cristiano Ronaldo and Georgina Rodriguez have been in Saudi Arabia for just over a year. They've adapted well to life in the Middle East, embracing the culture and their new surroundings. The couple recently took their kids for a vacation and were all smiles as they posed for Instagram pictures. Rodriguez uploaded a selection of snaps on her account with the caption, Ronaldo and Rodriguez took their five children, three born from surrogate mothers, with them to Saudi in January 2023. They have also adapted well to their new setting, and the legendary forward's eldest son Cristiano Ronaldo Jr. even plays in Al Nasser's Youth Academy. Banned from Al Nasser game, Cristiano Ronaldo romances with Georgina Rodriguez during gym workout Cristiano Ronaldo has been making the most of his time after being slapped with a ban. The Al Nasser skipper grabbed all the headlines following his team's 2-1 defeat to Al Hilal, with the player losing his calm and elbowing an opposition player. Well, despite the ban, it seems like Cristiano isn't going to let this affect him too much with the player spotted spending time with his girlfriend at the gym. The Portuguese superstar took to his Instagram handle to share a story of himself alongside Georgina, with the two cozying up in front of the mirror. Unfazed by the recent turmoil surrounding the player, the two seem to be in their own happy bubble. A few more images were shared of them in the gym. Cristiano is likely to address the drama revolving around his red card in an upcoming press conference, with the player unhappy with how things turned out in his last game. Al Nasser has had a heartbreaking season this time around with the team already knocked out of AFC Champions Cup and the Swati Cup. While the team is still in contention for the league title, the team is 12 points away from table toppers Al Hilal and it doesn't seem like Cristiano Ronaldo and his men will be able to catch up with his rivals anytime soon. The team's also chances of lifting the silverware might come from the King's Cup, where Al Hilal lay in wait to play spoilers. Is Cristiano Ronaldo done with the Saudi Pro League? The recent happenings have raised questions over Cristiano Ronaldo's future in the Saudi Pro League. It has been reported that the Al Nasser skipper is very frustrated with how the higher-ups at the league maintain the integrity of the tournament. Ronaldo is also not pleased with the recent bans imposed on him by the player reportedly claiming he has done what he would do in Europe in prior interviews. 
With the player set to present his stance in the coming weeks, there is a slight chance that CR7 could be done with the Saudi Pro League at the end of the season. With less than five games left in the ongoing campaign, Al Nasser could be without their captain services for the next two games. While Cristiano is serving a one-game ban for his red card, the Saudi Arabian Disciplinary Committee is also looking to impose an additional one-game ban on the game following his antics against Al Hilal. Cristiano Ronaldo loses legal battle against Juventus? Why did the Al Nasser star sue the old lady for $21 million? Cristiano Ronaldo has to be in a sour mood with all that's happened around him in the past 48 hours. The Al Nasser skipper had a night to forget against Al Hilal earlier this Monday after being sent off the field for losing his calm. Well, it looks like his temper won't be coming down anytime soon, with the player reportedly receiving a massive financial setback from the Italian courts. Okay, let's take a short drip down the memory lane. Turin was on cloud 9 in 2019, with Juventus securing the services of Cristiano Ronaldo from Real Madrid. The Portuguese superstar had a great run with the club, helping the team secure two Serie A titles, two Italian Super Cups, and one Italian Cup. The fairy tale run had a nightmare finish, with Cristiano parting ways with the club on rough terms. Cristiano Ronaldo was very vocal about his frustrations with the club following his departure, with the player suing the club for withholding his unpaid wages during his time at the club. In his lawsuit, Cristiano claimed that Juventus owed him around $20.8 million in unpaid wages, with a majority of the amount accumulating during the pandemic. Juventus has stood their ground in the case, with the club reporting that the player had signed a no-dues clause at the time of his departure. It seems like the court might rule in their favor, with rumors suggesting Cristiano. Italian court set to issue ruling in Cristiano Ronaldo's Juventus lawsuit in the coming weeks, a financial arbitration commission managed by the High Court in Turin will issue its verdict in the coming weeks in the high-profile case. According to reports from the Italian media outlet Tutosport, it probably looks like Juventus might have an upper hand over their former player in the legal battle. Notably, Cristiano Ronaldo signed a document during his move to Manchester United in 2021, declaring he had no dues with the club. The document has been Juventus's substantial asset in the case and could see them win the stretched-out lawsuit. Reports also suggest that Cristiano and Juventus had an agreement during the pandemic that saw the player give up on three months of his wages during the pandemic. It seems like Cristiano believes it was just a temporary agreement to alleviate the club's financial burden. Nevertheless, Juventus has successfully demonstrated that they are not legally obligated to do so. Perfect attitude band Cristiano Ronaldo breaks silence after being slammed for violent behavior during Al Nasser loss. Sport at the top level tests your mettle to the core. And when you're a known performer for many years, the expectations can get you under severe pressure. Notably, Cristiano Ronaldo may have been subjected to a similar situation this season. Despite scoring 36 goals this season, Al Nasser has been knocked out of two tournaments. After being sent off in the recent game against Al Hilal, the Portuguese star has come out with a message. Known to be a fierce competitor on the field, we saw Ronaldo losing his temper on the pitch. Nevertheless, the player now has a contrasting message of kindness via his Instagram. CR7 posted a photograph of an interior wall that had the caption. There are quite a few incidents where the Portuguese captain has displayed acts of benevolence to people around him. Known as one of the most charitable people in the world, Cristiano contributed to campaigns from the Save the Children campaign and World Vision. The player also helped victims of natural disasters like the Naples earthquake. Moreover, he also provided one of his hotels as an accommodation to victims of the Morocco earthquake last year. Apart from that, the 39-year-old has also shown kindness to his teammates by gifting them watches in 2014 after winning the Champions League.
Apart from that, the five-time Ballon d'Or winner donates his blood regularly and sacrifices his interest in tattoos for the same purpose. The current season has put his patience to the test with repeated pressure. The soccer fraternity blasted the player's attitude in the Saudi Super Cup game. Cristiano Ronaldo criticized for his behavior against Al Hilal Cristiano Ronaldo has once again faced criticism for his behavior, marking the second instance in just two months. After his confrontation with opponent fans regarding Lionel Messi chants, Ronaldo was now seen taking down an Al Hilal defender, Ali Al Bulehi, with his elbow. Subsequently, this led the fans and experts to call out the former Real Madrid striker with a 